Welcome back everyone, Zaf here. Two things I want to cover. First off, this patch notice is very important. Second off, the numbers for the first 1,000 defeats in the Hall of Fame for the Workshop of Brilliant Light was released. So let's see, did we make it? Are we on that top 1,000 list? I'll let you know in just a moment. But first off, as you know, I just released a video going over the difficulty of the Summer Crush event, how freeplay players were not having a very good time, the boss battles were honestly way too hard, even me as a paid one player, when I hopped onto it I was like whoa hold on, it was way too hard so, looks like the devs listened, thank goodness, I'm very happy to see that. This is why we voice our concerns, not because we're just complaining because the devs will actually listen if they hear us out. So just keep it up, anytime there's an issue, feel free to message me, post on our discord server, tag me, do whatever. I do not mind releasing this content, I want to make sure everyone is having a fun time and also, I want to make sure the devs know what's going on, I'm sure they saw in the forums but you never know. I'm sure these videos expedite the process to an extent, so I'm really glad they listen W devs, W content, W community, keep it up everyone honestly, this community is so great. But with that said, thank goodness, because on our previous video, where I did cover the angry reactions to the recent event, again the boss crush event. Let's just say the forum posts weren't very pleased, everyone was pretty mad I'll be honest. Which does make sense, releasing event content that is not doable is not a good sign. But anyways that should be fixed, we'll have to see. It would be funny if the difficulty was still pretty hard, oh that would be very awkward. But no I'm sure the devs did a good job and also, real quick, congrats to Cypherzy. From the first comment on our last video, here is your shout out and enjoy your very juicy Discord role. And also, if you have yet to join our Discord server, make sure you do so, otherwise you're missing out on the fun. We're close to 25,000 members, so you better join, the link will be down below. And I should mention for guilds as well, we are almost at our limit for our whale guild. We have three dolphin guilds and I think three or two free play guilds so far. And we have a ton of guilds on Discord server, just being ran by the community, so make sure you join. If you're a whale, I think we're looking for people around the 700k mark now, that being 700,000 total power. Just because we're kind of getting to the end, we're almost full. So if you want to apply for our whale guild, just make a support ticket on our server, then you'll be in contact with us. But if you're a regular player, like a dolphin, you can just follow the guild form, and again, someone will contact you. But please do remember, not everyone can be contacted. We've had over 4,000 applications so far. So please do note, not everyone can get into a guild. At least one of our guilds. There are plenty of guilds in our server, so make sure you join. But here we go, we have the mission update. Workshop of Brilliance Light. Vulcan Hardboat first 1,000 defeats Hall of Fame. So congratulations to 1,000 Hunters, who were first to defeat the Workshop Brilliance Light. The hard mode which is considered to be the most difficult mission. Hunters have shown great talent by overcoming all the difficulties until the end of defeating the workshop. And it looks like the thousand hunters will be remembered for eternity in Soul Leveling Your Eyes. So here is the list and the question is, did we make it? Well, I can tell you right now if we scroll down just a little bit more. And also I should note they are kind of censored, I guess it's for leaking purposes, I'm not sure we can use the name, but it is censored and if we go here, we search plays, boom bam, Zaf plays YouTube, right over here. I think we're around the 500-ish mark, so pretty good. So it looks like after 10 hours, 500 players did clear it, so not too bad, we know for the future to get on ASAP, clear the content when we can, otherwise we might miss out on the placement. And going down here, there's some more info as well. Let me show you as we go down. And like I mentioned earlier, they are ranked. So top left was first all the way to the bottom right. This is the last placing individual. They just made the cut. I bet they're so happy, must be hilarious, honestly. And anyone who hacked, cheated, etc. obviously is off the list. Good, I'm glad to see that. Cheaters are no fun. But interesting here, for the 1000 hunters, rewards including the Sung Jin Woo dyed costume will soon be distributed. Huh, I did not know it's getting a costume as well, very nice. And it looks like the rewards will be coming out in the next update, don't know if that's all the way in two weeks or so, I hope not. But going down, 
I believe 3,000 hunters have been Vulcan by now. We had 2,500, I think, a week and a bit ago. They did substantially nerf Vulcan, I can tell you right now. Hard mode is no longer hard. We can beat it with no blessings now, where before we needed all the right blessings. Oh, what a tough battle that was. So much fun. I hope the devs come out with more content like this. I do enjoy it. They can honestly do what they did before, basically making it a bit too hard and then nerfing it later on. That way everyone can clear it. I think that was the right move. That way the top, that way the best, that way the best of the best would clear it. And then everyone else who was just at the cusp can follow through. Very nice. I really enjoyed this event. Streaming it was so much fun. The grind, the struggle, the community support. Oh, what a wonderful time that was. So thank you everyone who tuned in. We'll do more streams like that. If the devs release content like this, which I sure hope they do. But yeah, it looks like there is a skin. Oh, interesting. I wonder what the skin's gonna be like. So we get a border, we get an icon, and also a profile background as well. Very nice. And it looks like every single player will get 30 marks a time for both the categories. 20 summons, 1 million gold, and I can tell you right now, I too need that gold myself. I'm running dry of gold. Could you believe that? Paid one players are running out too. Devs, please. Can we do a complaint post about that too? The gold cost in this game is outrageous. Oh, I can hardly afford anything nowadays. But anyways, we're also getting the fabric. Pretty cool. But yeah, looks like solid awards. I really want to see a dyed costume. That's exclusive. Probably looks very cool. I'll use that all the time. I can tell you that right now. So again, thank you devs for having that event. Very fun. I don't think there was anything else to cover here. There was the compensation post. Basically, 2,600 got diamonds. So if you use it, you would now have negative diamonds because, well, if your diamonds were used up, what will they do? So that's pretty interesting because these players right here got a 2,000 diamond injection straight into their account, even if they're free to play. So I want to tell you something funny. If you think about it, if you're a true free to play player, you'll have negative 2,000 diamonds as well. It's kind of like a mark on your account. Kind of funny if you ask me. But don't worry, if you had those diamonds, you still got the acid stones. And everyone who didn't get the diamonds got us and stones instead. It was an incorrect distribution. It happens, no worries. But it's kind of interesting that it's in a 25,000 batch. That might be the internal limit. So they do 25,000 at a time, I'm assuming. Not too sure. Well, that's good they did it that way. That way it was kind of easier to clean up, so it kind of makes sense. I'm sure whoever did that, well, probably got in a bit of trouble, but <laughs> you know, it happens, it happens. I'm sure all of us fat finger a key from time to time, so it is what it is, but yeah. Overall, good notices. The workshop update for the 1000 clears and also the patch notice, making the Summer Crush event much, much easier. So, tell me what you think. Are you happy with these changes? Are the devs pulling through? I think they are. I'm pretty happy with this. They're doing a good job. Just keep it up, listen to the community, and I guess we can try to get not too mad at them. Just hold them accountable when we can. But yeah, do drop a like if you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. That way I know you want more content like this. This was Zaf, signing out.